hi guys uh, welcome to leaves where you learn it from Shakespeare. please don't forget to subscribe so that you become the first person to view the new videos that i upload today we're going to look at excel i will show you how to access excel excel software i will show you the interface of uh, excel i will show you how to navigate horizontal and vertically i will show you some basic options that are under file or office button i will also give you some few definitions right so let's start with accessing excel software excel is just a software it's just a software which is uh, packaged within microsoft office suit right so for us to access it you just click on windows button which is found at the bottom left corner you just click it here are the programs that we are having i'm running windows 10 i scroll down scroll down up until i get to microsoft office this is microsoft office suit and in this suit or this package i will click the drop down here i find excel 2016 if you are having microsoft office version 2007 you will see 2007 instead of 2016 2018 if you are having 2018 version all right so i want to access excel 2016 i will just click it here or another way is i will right click on my uh, off on windows button and then click on search i will type in excel on the keyboard and here is the excel software so if you want to open it i'll just click it so let me just click it so that we open it is my excel software which is opening right so here it shows us some templates and this option which says blank workbook so here we are now creating a workbook right one may ask what is a workbook a workbook is just a single file containing several sheets called worksheets and these worksheets may contain different types of related information so this is the workbook this is the book that we have created so this workbook it's just like a literal book that we usually buy in shops and uh, it comes usually in in, in excel 2007 it comes with default three sheets but this one it comes with only one sheet i can add more by clicking on this i now have two sheets i can click to add more i can also delete by right clicking right click then click on delete there at the bottom here i can delete if i create another sheet it will come as sheet four so that is how we open or create a workbook and add or delete worksheets right i will go across it all right now let me leave it like that so this is how we access excel now let's look at the interface what do we have at the interface we have this bar which is appearing at the top left corner this bar is called the quick access bar where we have the save button so if you want to save your document you may come and click here or you can just click control plus s to just save you click you press control 
plus s on the keyboard then we have undo which you may access through control plus z on the keyboard and then we have redo which you can access by control plus y on the keyboard so these are the three buttons that we find in uh, quick quick access to bar you may customize it if you want to customize it right now let's look at uh, the tabs this area at the top here is called the tab bar this area is called the tab bar because it contains the tabs we call these tabs home tab insert tab page layout formulas data review and so forth these are the tabs so under each and every tab we have insert tab if i click on insert tab you will see that i am having different commands from the commands that i am having if i am under home so under home tab under each and every tab there are groups and they are shown or labeled by this name here this group is called clipboard so this is the clipboard group and this group demarcated by these lines is called font in this group you will be dealing with font this group is containing alignment commands this one is containing number commands and this one is styles cells editing so this is how excel software is arranged and this area with these commands grouped like this we call it the ribbon this is the ribbon right we now know the ribbon we know the tab bar with the tabs as they are shown we have this uh this bar or this box this box contains the name of the highlighted cell these are the cells and this area with the cells is called worksheet area worksheet area worksheet area right and uh, this is how we name the cells each and every cell is given a name if i click this you see the name of that cell appearing in this name box so we name each and every cell by giving it the alphabet cow character with uh, the numerical value so this is f6 like that that's the name and here that's where we put the formula we call this bar the formula bar we call this bar the formula bar right now let's look at um, let's look at um, file and the options under file i don't know what's going on my right if you are using another version which is which is 2007 or 2013 if not mistaken you may not have file you may not have file but you may have microsoft office button the options that you get after clicking microsoft office button are just the same as those that you get by clicking file so with file you can click on new to create a new excel document you can op click on open to open an existing excel file you can click on save save as you can print or you can encrypt or lock your document with a password 